Today is the first robotics event here at uh, Mount Olive School District. Uh, 50 odd, 40 odd teams are coming together to compete on their first competition. And the students had six weeks to build, design, build, test, and launch a robot that could pick up balls, put them in a basket, take a gear from a gear receiver, put it on a hook, and then climb four feet up. And these are all student-built robots with mentorship help. Uh, we sponsor 40 first robotics teams. Every robotics team gets one Picatinny mentor. Uh, Under Secretary of Defense puts in about $1,500 a team. Uh, we backfill it with another $3,500 a team. So the total uh, allowment to the teams is $5,000 per team, and we pay for our engineers and scientists to go out on our dime to, to, to participate. Um, I'm Nicole Taylor, and, and, and I'm the East Arlington Academy. Okay, so today is a huge event for all the robotics nerds. <laughs> so basically, um, we're competing today, um, and and this year's game called Teamworks. I think what's unique about it is that it's just so simple. <laughs> yeah, it's just so simple, and like, it's just elegant and just straight to the point. So like, um, if you look at our robot and you're like, okay, we know what they're doing. Yeah. The hardest part about designing it, um, it would actually have to be deciding how to make a robot that's simple, and like, and like I'm not too extravagant. Uh, my outfit was actually recycled. I used this piece last year in First Stronghold. That was the night. So I added the robotic parts to fit with steampunk, and I bought the tights. And I'm technically like a wind-up robot kind of toy. Well, it's uh, it's definitely stressful. You know, it's uh, it's the second competition, and uh, we're we're trying to work out the kinks, and we're trying to make our robot perform at its maximum capacity.